The Copilot Money team is so excited to be launching our web app. Let's take a quick walkthrough of what's in the app today. As of December 2025, Copilot Money is now available on web. We put a lot of care into crafting an experience that feels natural and fast on your desktop browser. We have most of the features and tabs that you love from the other apps with plans to add all of the additional tabs and features and actions pretty soon here. If you have any feedback as you're playing around with the web app, please let us know via the in-app chat. On the dashboard, you'll see all the elements you're familiar with across all platforms, including the dashboard spend chart, the net worth chart, your categories, recurrings, and of course, transactions to review. You can always tap on a transaction to see a detailed view of the transaction. You can also tap on elements within the transaction row to make quick edits in bulk, select transactions to review. In the transactions tab, you'll see all the familiar elements, including a full list of your transactions with details like tags, categories, indicators for recurrings, internal transfers, income, and the like. If you tap on a transaction, you'll see its details and you're able to edit any of them on the right side panel. Something new for the web app is improved filtering. You're able to filter by a lot of different fields, including some new date range filters here. If we select any filter, we'll be able to see a new bar, which shows you how many transactions any of the filters apply to, as well as the total spent, total income, and net for the selected transactions. In the accounts tab, you'll also see a pretty familiar view. You'll see your net worth chart with settings via the gear icon, all of your accounts listed, and a detailed view of any account that you select. In the investments tab, you'll be able to see the total balance for your accounts with options to edit what you see in the investments chart under the gear icon. In the categories tab, tap on the top chart to see total spend across all of your categories, as well as key metrics like spent per year and average monthly spend, and select any individual category to see the same metrics for a specific category. Lastly, in the recurrings tab, see a full list of your recurrings, including your paused and archived recurrings, select any recurring, see more details, including the filters used to identify the recurring transactions, and more information like key metrics, the account used, and transactions related to the recurring itself. And that's the Copilot web app. Like I mentioned, there's some tabs including cash flow and goals and features like split transactions that aren't available quite yet from the web app, but they'll be coming soon. Thanks so much for watching.